Hello folks. Just got this uh, vintage Singer sewing machine today. I bought it from eBay. This is a uh, 1947 model 201-2. Looks like it's in excellent condition. The decals are all in good position, good condition. This uh, machine sits flat on the table without a need for a base. This is one of the only two machines that Singer's made with a direct drive motor. Here it is. The motor. A so-called pilot motor. Pilot motor. Here's the balance wheel. Hand, hand wheel. This is uh, the top end, I believe, of the singers, vintage singers. They were so-called Rolls Royce of singers. They were more expensive than any other model. So this one's called uh, the dressmaker's model. While the cheaper 1591 in the background right here is called the farmer's wife's model. They're both excellent though. The 1591 right here is also has a potted motor direct drive. So these are the two singers the, the singers that uh, singers made that had the direct drive motor from that era. 1595. Looks like the condition of the 201 is a little bit better than the 1591, but both are in excellent condition. Seem to me the 201 seem to be uh, just a tad larger than the 1591. Is uh, the body is longer and taller compared to the 1591 right there. See this? This a significant difference. Even though both are full size machines, the bears are the bears are exactly the same length. But but there is some difference in the size, let me pull it up right here. The two oh one seem to be a little bit bigger, heavier. And the two oh one has a light in the front and a tensioner on the front. Well, the 1591 has a tensioner right over here, tension adjuster, and the light in the back. <clears throat> the 201 also has a plate for the for the thread spool, and it has a. Uh, this is a telltale sign of uh, 201. It has a light switch. Here goes the light switch, work, the light works. Here's uh, how it runs. Very smooth. That's just purring.
control smooth. The Rolls Royce of singers, vintage singers. And there is the farmer's wife's model, the 1591, also with a potted motor. This, uh, the 201, this one is from uh, 1947, and this one is made in 1948. Gorgeous machine. This will last, last several lifetimes. I'm just happen to be the current owner of these machines. Someday, somebody will, somebody else will own these. Maybe my kids, and maybe their kids. They don't build them like they used to now. Fantastic. The Rolls Royce of singers. Okay, let's okay, let's hear the difference between the fifteen ninety uh, fifteen ninety one to the two oh one dash two. Here's the fifteen ninety one. Here's a 201. Here's the difference. This is just a purr. It's still excellent. But not quite as silky as this. Both uh, direct dry machines, both driven from the part of motor. Both driven from the part of motors. Direct drive, gear driven. I, don't know, I may be mistaken, but it seems like the motor of the 201 is a tad bigger than that of the 1590, tad bigger, wider, I mean. I haven't measured it yet. I need to measure it with caliper. Seem to be, the 1590, 1591 seem to be just a tad smaller in the, in the overall size, including the motor. Hmm. Interesting. These are both, both are full size models. Turn on the light on this one. There you go. This one light works also. Both are excellent machines. <laughs>